If you have the desire and the motivation to start a painting business, we're going to give you two reasons why you should start that business right now. Brandon, what's number one? The first one is really interesting. It's a robot isn't going to take your job anytime soon. You think about the painting industry, a lot of technical work that needs to be done, a lot of precision work. Robots aren't there and will not be there for some time. You're 100% right. I mean, that goes into not only cutting in around trim, around doors, around windows, that's laying out some tape and getting it to lay flush so when you come back and put your paint on, it doesn't bleed underneath. I know somebody is working on a magic can where you just open it up, you set a timer, and walk out of the room, close the door, and it will just put the paint on the wall. Mr. Bean effect. The Mr. Bean effect. <laughs> yes. But that is definitely not there yet. Absolutely right. What's number two? Number two, there's low competition, but there's lots of competitors. When we say low competition, if you just do the basics of return phone calls, show up, use good quality products, do what you say you're going to do, you're already ahead of all the competitors out there. And this is a big market. We always know there's someone around the corner who's going to do it cheaper, but they're not going to do it as good as you. That's where you differentiate yourself. Yes, there's always going to be a bottom feeder. And that's just the truth. However, not everybody wants the bottom feeder. Some people just want a good job done and they're willing to pay for it. That is your market. And those are the people that you need to go to. We'd love to hear from you ponderers. If there's anything that we missed, leave that in the comments section below and we'll see you next time.